Welcome back to the channel and today we're going to cover opening up a new piece of kit that I have bought for my mortal vlogging and that is the newer lighting kit. On my last video which I reviewed the, the unboxing of the purple panda mic I noticed that the video was a bit a little dark, the lighting wasn't right. So I thought I'll invest in uh, some cheap lighting initially to see how I get on with it. And these guys were £38 off Amazon. And so I'll go through a, an unboxing and see what we get. So this is the newer two pack lighting kit. Let's see what we get in the box. This is actually my first unboxing. So everything is literally as it's shipped. So we have one unit. They're not bad in size. Uh, they are USB powered. And they have a, a controller on the end here for on off and up and down on brightness. From my understand that there's 10 settings of brightness on there. So that's one unit. Put that aside here. And we have the second unit. And they look identical, and well, they should be identical. The switch on there. That's two. We have some installation instructions. And some gumph under here, customer service, etc. And I believe we have these filters that we can actually put in front of the unit. They're yellow, blue, and red. There's two sets of these. Okay. Anything else in the box? Ah, there we go. We've got the stands. Two sets of these. Let's have a look at one. And here we go. So this is one stand. Four legs. Extends. And we're fixing at the top the mounting. And I presume the unit goes on top here. So that's two of these. So let's get the box out of the way and let's see the full setup. So that's one of these. Two of these. Two filters. Some information paperwork and finally two of these units one and two the interesting thing is that these are USB powered is obviously you need a, something with a USB source power source on there so I was thinking either lugging a laptop or um, hooking it to a, a monitor, if the monitor has a USB port. But it actually will work off one of these power blocks they use for recharging your phone, etc. So we have that in there. You can see the blue lights come on. And there we go. Which is interesting. So that gives us the option of moving these around where you need to do your shoot, your, your vlogging without having to worry about where's the USB power source. You can always add an adapter and stick it in the wall, of course, but I think this gives a, a unique solution for portability. So, on. Let's check the settings, that must be full power. Take it down, I believe there's 10 settings. Yeah, so it's so one, one, two, three, Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. There we go. 
Right, well, I shall test these out uh, in my next video, set up the lighting, and see if that's any better than this one that I've just done. Right, so <clears throat> let's look at what we've got. We've got the, the stand. And we've got the, the mount at the top here. So if we can put that on there. Thusly, and we will then put the, the light freely. Yeah, here we go. And we can do it that way around. And here we have it. If I undo the cable in here, there's a bit of cable tie and attach it to my USB power block here. We can watch it lighting up. There we go. And I think the lighting should be much better on the next video. Take it down a bit, I think. Versus what I have been getting. Which is just a combination of either the indoor lighting, as I did on my first video for the unboxing of the Purple Panda. It was done in the evening. Versus now, which I have a bit of natural light coming in through the window. And this new fill light that I'm going to put on either side of me and test out different strengths one primary one secondary uh, and just see how the, the shadows uh, work and so hopefully the next video should have better better lighting but otherwise as a purchase 38 pounds of Amazon so far so good but we shall see during the testing